Hi guys, I am back and today I'm bringing you my December favorites. I feel like I kind of shopped my collection this month and really started loving things that I already had. Um, and I also have a couple of new things that I want to share. So anyways, here's my December favorites video. I think I'm going to start off with lips. Okay. First thing I have been loving this month that is a lip product is this C Booth Simple Natural Trusted Butter Up Gloss Over Duo. So it comes with this side, which is the Iced Mint Gloss. It is a roller ball. This is all right, whatever, not the part that I have been exceptionally loving. The side that I have been loving is this side. This is the Lemon and Butter SPF 15 side, and it looks like this. Doe foot applicator, smells lemony and kind of like a sugar cookie at the same time. It smells freaking amazing, and it is just so moisturizing, and it just works so well at protecting your lips from the outside winter weather and just keeping them nice and moisturized and I've been loving it because it also looks good because it gives kind of your lips like a nice little like um shine to them and the next lip product I have been loving is this Tarte Elite Lip Surgeons. This is the lip tint version. I know they come in like creams and lusters and stuff but this is the lip tint version and it is kind of like a ready deep coral looks like that and I really have been loving it because my skin tone doesn't really go great with reds. I know I'm saying this as I'm wearing a red lip but I went a little out of my comfort zone today because it's Christmas time. It's a day before Christmas Eve. I don't know. I just wanted to be a little festive with my red lip but normally I don't go for red lips because I don't think it looks the best on me but I really really like this shade because I think it does look the best on me. It's like my version of doing a red lip. Okay, moving on. I'm going to go to blush. I have been loving this blush. This is the Ultima Cheek Color Wonder Wear in Wonder Tawny. I said Wonder Wear, not underwear, just in case you thought differently. Anyways, it looks like this. It is like a dusty rose kind of mauve tawny color. Like it says, Wonder Tawny. It's so pretty. It looks matte on the skin, but it has a slight right there it has like a slight kind of um satin finish it's just really natural and like a really great fall and winter color so I've been loving wearing that I have been loving this product this is the Ulta glitter eye top coat in the shade fairy princess literally this thing is just packed full of glitter really nothing else in there not much of a base just glitter chunky glitter and it looks like this, super chunky, glittery, sparkly, shiny. Um, what I like doing with this, like it says, it is a top coat. So what I like doing with this is um, putting it, sometimes dabbing it with my finger on top of eyeshadows I already have on, or, which I have been especially loving, is putting this over like a gel liner, either on the top or bottom lash line. It doesn't really matter, but I like it, the gel liner because it gives this something to just stick to, and it just transforms any gel liner into something a little bit more festive, a little bit better, and I love it. Okay, bronzer. I've been loving this bronzer. This is the Ulta Minerals Bronzer in the shade Bronze Glow looks like this. I would say it's a medium toned, more on the cool side of bronzers. It's really nice for um, this time of year for me because I feel like it just goes well with my skin color at this time of year and it looks great. I love applying it with this brush. This is the Sonia Kashuk Flat Top Kabuki brush and what I like doing is when you have a flat top brush like this, it creates more of an edge along here. So what I like doing is putting this edge in the powder. Now you can see how the edge now has bronzer on it. Taking the edge and putting it in my contour. Where I contour up here, up here on my nose, on my nose, in the hollows of my cheeks. Then taking the flat top and then buffing it all in. And I feel like it just, it makes it easy for me to place precisely where I want the color. And then it makes it easy to blend the color with this brush. So I have been loving these two combined in December. 
Okay, moving on, I have been loving this. This is the Pond's Dried Skin Cream. It smells really nice and soothing, I would say. I have been using this a lot lately because my skin has just been extra dry. So um, yeah, I put my regular moisturizer on places that is normal for me right now, and then I put this on places that are extra dry, which has normally been around my nose and actually the top of my cheekbones. So. I've been loving this. This stuff will last you forever. It works amazing. I highly recommend it if you have dry skin or even if you have dry skin patches because I don't have dry skin at all. I have oily skin, but this is like the first time in my life where dry patches have shown up on my face and this has definitely helped me out. Okay, next is a perfume that I picked up this month, which I have been obsessed with probably for like two years. Couldn't find it anywhere. My friend has it. I literally douse myself in it every time I go to her house. It smells so good. This is the Mariah Carey perfume. I want to say it is in the irresponsible irresistible I can't read it it's really small irresponsible or irresistible something like that I just know it was the pink butterfly one smells so good I have no way of describing this to you but it just smells so good and it was $16 for this which isn't that bad I found it actually at Target of all places and I really just I like cherish this thing like I don't ever want to use it because I don't want it to go away but like I love it. Like, I absolutely love this perfume. Okay, moving on to hair. This is the Redken Wool Shake Gel Slush Texturizer. Now, this stuff smells really good. You can shake it up. It smells like man. It smells like sexy man. I don't know why. It just does. Love the way it smells. Anyways, I usually use this when my hair is... Um, wavy or curly on like my second day hair just because this stuff gives you so much volume like ridiculous amounts of volume it is absolutely great you just spray it normally I spray it like towards the roots kind of not necessarily up here not down here kind of in this little sweet spot right here I spray it and then I just scrunch it and it just leaves your hair so volumized and it, it really um kind of acts like a hairspray too. I use it normally on second day hair and my hair is flat. If you want like just rolled around in the hay kind of look, this will give you that. So amazing, smells good, super voluminous, love it. Okay, last product I think. This is something, there's a story behind this product. Um, my teacher actually has this product on her desk at school and I walk in her class and I put it on every single day. My friends always make fun of me because I love it. I love the way it smells. I love the way it feels. I just love it. And then my friend Melissa for Christmas got me this. She had to order it offline because they didn't have it in stores. And um, yeah, she has a YouTube channel, which I will link below, but she got me this I know it's weird this is the ocean potion moisturizing aloe lotion it apparently extends tan life has antioxidants tree tea tree oil and it has vitamin d3 really the only reason why I like it is because it smells like fruit loops it smells citrusy and fruity it just smells like fruit loops to me like a little Citrus, more citrusy than Fruit Loops, but pretty much Fruit Loops. I love it, and I actually haven't even used this bottle yet. Um, but yeah, I use it pretty much use it every day at school. So, anyways, been loving this it's probably since the beginning of school, but now that I own it for myself, definitely a December's favorite. So that is everything I finished in the not finished. Why do I always do this? Literally, all my favorites video at the end, I'm like, oh, that's everything I finished. Like, no, this is not an empties video. It's a favorites video. Anyways, that is everything I've been loving in the month of December. I hope you guys like this video, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.